don't have Starbucks for a long time. Like, you can't do it if you do a Starbucks all the time. Skip it for like a month and get you a cup of coffee. Best thing ever. Hello, everybody, and welcome back. I don't even want to put this coffee down. All right, everybody, welcome back. That was quick. <laughs> As you notice, I just put a video up. I'm more chipper now. When I did that video, actually, I was a little sick. Like, I felt really nauseous, but I still did the video. So, I'm my bubbly self now, looking a little better. I mean, I don't even know what I had on or what I did, but anyway. Hey, guys. I'm back for this quick video. I, you know how you, you saw in the beginning in the intro how I was cleaning out my little linen closet. So for those who don't know, you may be new. I don't have any room for a IKEA closet. When I get my forever home, when I retire, um, which I am getting a condo, I have decided I don't want a house. Um, I'm still not going to get any type of a Kia closet. I will, however, have some type of closet that I create myself. So I took my empty linen closet and I just made it. It has shelves. So that's where I go and put all of my, not all, some of my more precious things. Put it that way like my perfumes and stuff like that. So I showed you a little, just so you can go back in my videos. I have a whole thing about it, but some of my perfumes. And I got um, two new ones. You would have seen that on the video before the last one where I have my uh, newest two is Flores and uh, Honey Oud. That's one of them in the Jimmy Choo, I Want You. So I also had coming um, something from, what's the name of this place? Avant Garde. Is that the name of it? Let me see. Don't get me the line. Uh, so Avant Garde. So that is, uh, I'll put their Instagram right here. So they have more they have all perfumes, but they also have your more high end. So I wanted to try Tiziana Terenzi, but they are high. Do you understand me? They are high. I don't want to do a blind buy, but I want to try the house. So I got the discovery set. So what I'm going to start doing is before I try any of the higher brand perfume houses, get the discovery set. It's like $50 for the discovery set. And believe it or not, I know people say $50 for some samples. Well, it's a little more than a sample and you get to try the house, you know, a, a, a multitude of their different uh, perfumes, not just the one you heard about, you may, you can try ones you ain't even heard about. So you may find that you like one of them better than the one that you really trying to find out about. So I'm going to do a few of these little mini videos because I'm going to try some different perfumes and I'm going to try the discovery set. And we're going to open them together, see how the packaging is, see what they give you, see, you know, what perfumes did I find or fragrances did I find I liked out of this set? So theirs came boxed and then it came in this wrapping like this. So you're going to unwrap it with me. <laughs> okay. So let's find out what's in here. So I'm going to dump them all out and I'm going to go over them one by one. So I was trying to figure out what is this big thing? So I hope you can see it. So let's see what this is. It says 
Tiziana Terenzi and it is the Almond Vanilla Black Glass. <laughs> so let's see what this is. It's a candle. Wow. Look at that. And their discovery set is a candle. Oh my goodness, this smells. Mmm. And look at the wick. Oh, this smells good. I'll let you know how it smells. That smells delicious. It smells like something you didn't I didn't cook. All right, so let's look at the first thing. The first thing I have is it's a a what do they call it? A astrate? A, a, mm. It's an Estrade de Perfume Gold Rose Oud. So it's Gold Rose Oud. So let's see how it smells. I don't want to waste any of it, but I'm going to put it on... This is definitely, mm, this smells good, but this is definitely a winter scent. It's boozy. It's, uh, this is definitely for a man or woman, so it is unisex. Let me tell you the notes. The main notes are rose, woody, oud, fresh spice, Patchouli, warm spice, floral, honey, pottery, and y'all know I'm not gonna be able to pronounce these names right. But I'm gonna put the name there. You'll see the picture in the name. So you might say, girl, you don't know what you're talking about. I can't find what you're talking about. Okay, so let's see about this one. Oh my god, this one is drying down, guys, and it reminds me of some type of um, soap, but very much stronger. Okay, let me put it that. Y'all not gonna be wasting my stuff. Okay, wait a minute now. You didn't send me a default one, did you? I ain't even sprayed this and I can count. Okay, there we go. So let's see how this one. Whoa. Whoa. I can smell. Boy, these is not no, this, this is no, these are not, look, my bra strap coming down and everything. These are not no, I'm just going to wear this to go to the store, get some groceries. This stuff is projecting. I'm doing dots on this paper. And it is like, bam. This one smells so good. It smells, what it is, it's, it's, it's like so overwhelming. Like it's like, um, it's not like you spray like you spray a Chanel and you know, I love my Mademoiselle. This is a, um, a beast mode. <laughs> Let's talk about the notes. The main notes is woody, powdery, violet, white floor, aromatic, citrus, sweet, fresh, fruity, and fresh, spicy. So they kind of got, let me find that one. So this one, that powdery is there, that floor, that white floor definite. And then the woody. So it's still unisex. A lot of theirs is unisex, but to me, the more it dry down, the more feminine it becomes because of that powdery note. So the next one is Deluxe. So let's see how this one smells. The next one is Deluxe. Now, I've heard uh, people talk about this one. 
So I definitely want to try this one. These ain't no joke. These ain't no joke. You cannot play around when you buy these. Oh, my goodness. This one. Deluxe. Let's talk about it. The main notes is rose, vanilla, honey. Uh, it's sweet, it's floral, it's powdery, it's coffee, amber, musky, and warm spice. I love amber. And everything has that powdery, but this one is definitely, even though it says it's unisex, this one is, oh, this one smells so good. I don't know if it's that rose, vanilla, and honey. Oh, my goodness. So far, that's the one I want. Oh, it smells so good. So, so far, I'm not, all of them smell good, but that deluxe, I hope that's what it's spelled, uh, how it's pronounced. That one smells really good. Okay, so the next one is too tall too tall i don't know but it's unisex woody fruity citrus pottery arom aroma aron wrong oh, wait a minute aromatic floral white floor leather earthy and patchouli now i don't really like earthy scents but let's hope it's not too earthy Remember I told you I don't like things that be saying earthy. So let's try this one. I told y'all I be trying to do a mid skirt. I mean, <laughs> I be trying to do a mid squirt. I don't even want to squirt it because I don't want to waste none of this. So this one is Tootal. Probably called Tutelli. Oh, this one, I do smell the citrus more. I do smell the citrus more in this. That's definitely the fruit in the citrus, definitely. This one is, I can smell, the more it's drying, the more I can smell the earthy uh, scent, the earthiness of it. That's not my favorite. So that one, um, it's not bad. If you like that earthy citrus type of smell, uh, it's definitely, it's not as powdery as the other one. So that one I'm not going to say, I know they all, yeah, and the more it dry down, the more I smell that leathery, uh, it's, it smells more on the man, on the, um, on, it leans more masculine. That one leans, uh, masculine. All right, let's find the next one. Haley. And what I like is they all say Astrad. So that's nice. Guys, we're going to have fun with these, doing these um, type of things. The packaging for this was 10 out of 10. And they gave me a candle? Absolutely. All right, so this one, what, what did I say this was? Haley. So let's look that one up. Okay, so Haley... Haley is fruity, sweet, powdery, musky, vanilla, tropical, fresh, woody, green, and aromatic. I can smell the musk and the fruity. This one reminds me of outdoors. So I can smell the green. And you know how I feel about greenery and... Anything that has to do with the outdoors. It's not bad. Um, it's still not one of my ones that I don't like that, that outdoor smell with the grass and all that. 
So that one it would not be one of my choices. So the next one is Orion. So let's look at that one. <clears throat> and of course it's unisex. This one is fruity, woody, smoky, leather, sweet, amber, aromatic, fresh, fresh spice, and it is an oud. So let's see how this smells. Squirt a lot. Oh, great. Oh, good. All right. So, the, look at the beautiful bottles they come in. Oh, yeah. I definitely do not like this. This, I smell the fruit, but. That smoky leather, when it has smoky or leather, it definitely leans more masculine. And those are not smells that I really like. Doesn't stink, but the leather and the fruit, I don't, for some reason, I don't like those together. I'm gonna put it on my skin and wear it, honey. Trust me, I'm not putting this in my humidifier. I'm gonna put these on. All right, so the next one is. Andromeda. Now, this one I heard about as well. I'm quite sure if you've watched any uh, fragrance videos that talked about Tiziana Terenzi, Andromeda was one of them. I'm quite sure. It has woody, sweet, vanilla, white floral, amber, um... Regular fruity, floral, powdery, yellow floor, and green. Uh, let's see. Hmm. At first sniff, it's very fruity. That detox don't make no daggone sense. Don't make no daggone sense. That is the one I'm going to get. I might get me that for my birthday. I was thinking about what birthday gift do I want to give myself. So this Andromeda. It's not as good as the detox. I think I'm going to... What I do with it, Lord, I mix them all together. I might put that Andromeda on. I'm going to put this on my skin. Just a squirt. Because y'all ain't going to have me wasting my stuff up here. Mm, that Andromeda is, it is definitely powdery and sweet. So this one leans more, very much more to me on the feminine side. Okay, so the next one. So, so far, Detox and Andromeda is my favorite too. This one is Rosso. So let's find this one. And they have a lot of, a lot. This one only has certain um, collections. But they got a lot of perfume. So this one, okay. Rosso Pompeii. Yep. This one is citrus, woody, amber, Patchouli, aromatic, animalic, animalic, what? Amalic, Anna. Mm. 
balsamic fruity and warm spice so you got some animals going up in here what do you mean animalic mm. this strong Ooh, and it says for women This is definitely not a blind buy, honey. Don't do that. This is for women? I don't know. I don't know what this smell is. I can't. It was very strong in the beginning. Very strong. It was so strong I couldn't tell what it was. This is very strong. It's it's overwhelming with something that I can't put my hands on. I don't know if it's that animalic scent or what. Definitely has the woody and the citrus together. It's odd. It's odd. It is, um, if you spray with their, I see that with their fragrances, if you overspray that, you will knock somebody out. You have got to be careful with these scents. But I will give an update because I'm going to wear them on my skin and I'm going to see how it is. So Detox and Andromeda so far is my favorite too. But I'm going to wear them all. Even if I got to wear it around the house, I'm going to wear it so that I can give an update uh, during one of my videos. Well, that's it, guys. I'm not even doing a scripture today. This is a drive-by. <laughs> this is a drive-by extra video. I just wanted to do the sampling of my discovery set. And we will do this. If you got a discovery set you would like for me to try and give you uh, feedback on it and try it and see how the packaging is and everything. You know I did Zara. I did a discovery set for Zara. It doesn't have to be a famous house, but I am only going forward getting houses that we know. We don't know if we will ever buy the perfume because that mess too high. If they got a discovery set, I will get it and we will come up here and we will talk about it. Okay, guys, thank you. And don't forget, no matter where you are in your transformation, you still beautiful to me. Bye, guys.